what is up everybody welcome to another guacamole cards hobby box review uh, of course this channel is all about bringing you the latest hobby boxes uh, reviewing them so that you know where to spend uh, your hard-earned money today we have one of my absolute favorite products I've been so looking forward to this uh, immaculate football um, so please buckle up we're gonna have fun uh, if you like this video, I'd appreciate a like and subscribe, and also uh, check out my Instagram at uh, Guacamole Cards. So thanks again, everyone, for tuning in. We blew past 100 subscribers. Uh, we continue to grow the channel. I'm immensely appreciative. So let's jump right in. Uh, Immaculate, you know, I love this product. Uh, if you watched my um, rip and review of Collegiate, uh, where we hit a Joe Burrow uh, RPA, uh, had a lot of fun in that one, of course. Now we're stepping up uh, to the big leagues in NFL. Um, I was surprised that uh, the, at the price point on these. Only 775 direct from Panini. Uh, I got it via eBay, but I got it at 775 uh, They did sell out like in two minutes. Uh, like, like just immense demand for it. So really surprised the price point came in where it did. Uh, especially considering, you know, NBA was trading between $2,000 and $3,000. Uh, you know, I, I know I understand NBA is a little different, but still, uh, seven seventy five dollars is a great price for a product like this. Yes, you only get six cards, so it's over $100 a card. I get it, uh, but this is a high-end set, and in my personal opinion, I like this more than National Treasures. Uh, it's pretty close to flawless. Uh, based on what I've seen, I kind of like the design of Immaculate a little better than Flawless. Of course, though, Flawless is its own beast. So uh, as I rip, let's dig into a few statistics on this thing. Um, so, you know, every base card is numbered in this product. So Panini did this, that favor, and um, we're able to do some quick math. Uh, and by doing that, we see that there's 12,000 boxes of this produced or 2,000 cases. Um, most, what I like about this is the player pool is pretty small. Uh, most of the rookie uh, auto patches, uh, most of those series only are 25 to 30 players deep. Um, and yeah, you have like your Jacob Eason's in there and then... Uh, you know, James Morgan sneaks into a few, but for the most part, it's your premier guys. There's not going to be, you know, what we saw with Prism, where we pulled a seventh round draft pick who's not even on a team anymore in his college uniform, uh, number to five auto. You know, that that's that card shouldn't even exist. It's kind of, I think, Panini should honestly kind of be embarrassed that that card exists in a thousand dollar product. But here we are. This is a $775 product, and the player pool is a lot smaller. Uh, what I also like about this, um, there's 1,800 one of ones. So you have almost a one in six chance of hitting a one of one, of one which is very cool. Um, let me go just look at the back here. If you're interested in this kind of stuff, uh, you know, your uh, standard disclaimer information. I uh, really love the packaging. Um, you know, really love um, everything about this product. So we're going to jump in. Uh, in addition to those one of one odds I just discussed, um, there's also about 6,000 cards numbered to five or less. So you have about a 50% chance of hitting a short print numbered to five or less. So look at that packaging. I, I just love like the the whole like luxury look of it all. Very cool. And I save these tins. Usually, usually you watch some videos, sometimes I just toss them around. But uh, I like these tins and I save them. Uh, I've got my Dak Prescott uh, mosaic rainbow going in the background. I did want to put that up, show you guys one thing really quick for you mo mosaic collectors. This one, second to the left, that's a purple number to 49 or to 40 maybe. I don't, I'm not sure. This is the camo pink. They look pretty close. So uh, if you're out there, mosaic rainbow building. Uh, be on the lookout for the difference between the purple and the camo pink. Unnumbered, you know, this was like a $2 card. That's numbered, you know, costs a little bit more. So uh, just something to be aware of. All right, let's dig into the rip. You've heard uh, enough uh, of this other chit chat. Uh, I have seen in some other videos I've watched, 
uh, some blockchains in here as well. Uh, so and it would, just as a bonus card, um, it looks like maybe like two per case. So I'm hoping we hit a blockchain just as a bonus. Um, I don't know how blockchain really does, but uh, it would be a cool bonus to have. And also I have seen some short print, um, you know, I, I don't even know what they're called. And, and every single one has been like Bill Bates or Bob Lilly. Uh, it's kind of been interesting. Uh, but like Chromium uh, Refractors, Refractor Autos from, you know, old Super Bowl heroes. So uh, that does replace one of your six cards. So we'll be on the lookout for those as well. Uh, there are some redemptions still out here as well. So um, we'll be on the lookout for those. Does not look like I hit a blockchain, but that's okay. So let's get into it. Card number one. This is going to be our base card, uh, you know, numbered up to 60. And let's see what we got here. So we have Gardner Minshew, 6 out of 60 as our base card. So uh, probably not going to be the starting quarterback for the Jags uh, very long. Uh, but nice card. You can see, like, they just look, they just look so nice. Love Immaculate. So I did want to do this. Um, quick tip I learned from watching other videos with these, uh, you know, when you're loading up your, your sleeves, um, you know, take your knife and just cut the corner. And that prevents you from uh, dinging the corners. So I did the other ones already, but I wanted to show you that in case you'd never seen it. And then they go in nice and easy. So Gardner Minshew. Let's see card number two. Oh, very cool. Triple patch, Jonathan Taylor, 25 of 49. So that's a really cool patch over here. This is an acetate as well. So I did sell my Origins Jonathan Taylor, um, you know, right when he was like at the bottom of kind of where his season's been. And he's picked it up since then. So nice to pick up another little uh, JT. This is a nice card too. Nice patch. right and I'll go ahead and top load this one as well uh, I picked up 200 so I hope that's the right size yeah perfect perfect fit so in fact to keep track of them put Jonathan Taylor right over here so and off to a pretty decent start uh, card number three is very nice we have a Nike swoosh Darius Slayton, numbered four out of five. Very cool. Uh, very, very cool. So, like I said, you have about a 50% chance of hitting your know, number to five or less, and sure enough, we did it. That's a nice uh, Nike swoosh. Not a rookie, not a premier player, but still very nice. I've never hit. I have a a Rudy Gay swoosh that looks like it's from a sock or something, but no, never one that big. That's cool. Thought maybe for a second it would have been a one of one of one as well, but uh, no such luck. All right, card number three. Remember only or four. I'm sorry. Remember only six cards in here. So here's an auto. We have a Thurman Thomas Acetate on card. Marks of Greatness. 10 out of 25. Very cool. Of course, the Bills uh, with the resurgence here. That's a cool card. Thurman Thomas. The other thing about Immaculate, you're pretty much never going to find yourself like just having a crap box at least not from what i've seen like so far we haven't hit any monsters yet but so far this has been pretty good so we we're four cards in two to go card 
card number five. Harrison Smith to 99, triple patch on card acetate. Very cool. One more card to go. Let's see if we can hit a monster. Let's use Gardner Minshew to cover him up here. So last card. It's a rookie Raven, J.K. Dobbins. 72 of 99. Nice patch on card very cool so jk dobbins uh nice hit so we got uh, two premier running backs out of here which is nice we got jonathan taylor got jk dobbins did not continue our herbert hot streak but uh that's okay uh all oh, the great cards here um very pleased uh with this box um that big nike swoosh is very cool three cool autos and there you have it so nice little box um, I do like this product so uh, let's talk about the ratings really quick um, card quality appearance I mean it's 15 out of 15 for me these are beautiful cards um, and they're in great shape you know the acetate finish really gives them some durability you know these are all on card autos we don't have any stickers here Fantastic. Uh, inserts and parallels. Um, you know, I don't know. I guess you call this an insert. Uh, but I really just think it's, you know, a series. Um, you know, we have Players Collection, Marks of Greatness. Uh, this I would call a true rookie. Uh, we've got the triple patch. Uh, we got our base. we got our insignias. But all great. Um, uh, I gave it 18 out of 20. Personal collection appeal, 15 out of 15. Like, if you're collecting a player... Like, you're going to want his Immaculate at some point, his Immaculate Rookie. Um, it's just, you know, these are premier, premier cards. Love it. Uh, investment Outlook. You know, with this class of quarterbacks, now we have four legit quarterbacks, and we haven't even seen Jordan Love yet, but we've got Burrow. We've got two. Of course, we've got Herbert. He's going to be Rookie of the Year. Hertz looks great. Uh, so have Jordan Love. Jacob Eason maybe something. Um, you know, so I think... If you're looking to invest in wax, I think this is a great set to do, it, especially at only $775. Uh, and then value, because it's only $775, which, again, I know that's a lot of money uh, for six cards, but I still think it's a great value for what you get. I gave it a 23 out of 25 for an overall grade of 93. Uh, one of the highest products, uh, highest grades I've given to any product. Like, I think this is something to buy for sure. Um, and we'll see how, um, you know, my wife feels about it. Probably not great, but maybe I'll look to uh, pick up another box. Uh, maybe she won't watch this far in the video and find out that I just said that. So there you go. There's Immaculate. I do have um, Obsidian first off the line that just came in. I I'm going to rip that and record that right now. That'll be up in a few days. Uh, I'll probably put it the night before. Uh, it releases um, on Panini's website, so you can take a look, decide if it's something you want to buy. Uh, so this is it for Immaculate. Thank you all for watching. Uh, please do like, subscribe, and uh, share with your social network uh, if you wouldn't mind. I definitely appreciate it. And until next time, happy ripping.